Alright, Shalom Israel. I want to give all praise on and glory to Yahweh Bashimi Hawashai. That my honesty to the apostles and others with great millstone. And Shalom to the electman doing his work and truth and sincerity. And as we know, you know, the last few days, Jake been getting shot down left and right. It's crazy. You know, the uh, police been going in on Jake, man. But really, that's prophecy, man. So, you know, just want to get a few scripts. You know, just showing how the Lord uh, uh, set that all up, man. This is Isaiah chapter 42, and I'm going to start at verse 13. The Lord shall go forth as a mighty man. He shall stir up jealousy like a man of war. Now, what you got, you know, you got Jake being shot down day in and day out. Well, before, really before they, uh, Esau been doing that, but now they're making it live. Now they're making it public, man. So it says the Lord shall go forth as a mighty man. He shall stir up jealousy, jealousy like a man of war. Now he got Jake, you know, that's how the most high is going to um stir up the race wars, man. Because in the, in the, in the precepts, in the scriptures, it actually prophesies about race wars. So what the most high is doing with these, you know, different Jake's being shot down by the uh, police, you know, um, and then the police actually getting off. What he that's how he's stirring up jealousy like a man of war. He shall cry. Yeah, roar. He shall prevail against his enemies. I have long time holding my peace. And right, man, the most high has long time holding his peace, man. He had us out there, you know, <coughs> had the prophets out there for a minute, man, preaching the downfall, pre pre preaching of the downfall of this, pre of this place, All right, preaching of bad times to come. So now, you know, he have, he ha he's having those things come into fruition. I have a long time holding my peace. I have been still and refrained myself. Now will I cry like a travailing woman. I will destroy and devour at once. And that's what the Most High is doing. All right. He's destroying two thirds of our people by uh, having Esau kill these niggas left and right. And he's also uh, destroying Esau's kingdom, man. All right. By having rights, by having people, uh, you know, go crazy in this place, man. That's how he's destroying the kingdom, man. You know, he's bringing the people against this, uh, this wicked kingdom, man. I will make waste. Mountains and hills and dry up all their herbs and I will make the rivers islands and I will dry up the pools and I will bring the blind by a way that they knew not. And right, you know, who who are some of the blind, man? Israel to two thirds of Israel, man. You know, when we go out there and we tell them that the white man don't, don't like them, you know, they come up against us. You know, they don't, they, they don't think that is so. So it says. I would bring the blind by a way that they knew not. And what's the way that they knew not? That the white man's the devil, man, to come up against this white man. I will lead them in paths that they have not known. I will make darkness light before them and crooked things straight to know the evilness and the wickedness of the so-called white man, man. All right. These things will I do unto them and not forsake them. So the Most High is going to put the spirit on Jake to go up against these devils, man, as you see, man. That's why you had, you know, uh, the, the past few days, you know, Jake shooting down cops, man. There's, there's no coincidence, man. That's scriptural. These things will I do unto them and not forsake them. They shall be turned away. They shall be greatly ashamed that trust in graven images that say to the molten images, ye are of gods, man. Ye are our gods. All right. You, you see now, man, that our people, even though they're stiff necked and hard headed, what? You know, for for believing in the so-called white man, for believing in his system, that he's actually for them. Now they see that he's not, man. That's how the most high making them ashamed. Now the people that, the same people that actually stood up for the white man is now actually coming up against him, man. Hear ye deaf and look ye blind that ye may see. So the most high called Israel deaf and blind, man. It says that ye may see. Who is blind but my servant? Or who deaf as my messenger that I sent? So the Most High is basically being facetious. Who is blind as he that is perfect and blind as the Lord's servants? All right. Who's the Lord's servants, man? Us, man. Via the, uh, the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. What? Us, man. All right. We are the men. What? That's that's that that's the Lord's servants, man. That come out there in the spirit of prophecy. You know, prophesying the downfall of this place. You know, prophesying uh, what's to come, man. You know, that's the spirit, man. We, we are the uh, prophets, man. So I'm going to get one more precept real quick. Bear with me, Akin. 
All right, this is uh, Ezekiel chapter 2, verse, let me start, verse 1. And he said unto them, Son of man, stand upon thy feet, and I will speak unto thee. And the Spirit entered unto me when he spake unto me, and he set me upon my feet. Showing you how the prophets are not blind, man, but the prophets are the actual ones that see, man. That I heard him that spake unto me. And he said unto me, Son of man, I send thee to the children of Israel, to a rebellious nation that have rebelled against me. They and their fathers have transgressed against me even until this very day. That's why in Isaiah the forty second chapter the most high um basically said that, you know, you're gonna be ashamed that have, you know, um went after the graven images. For they are impudent children and stiff hearted. I do send them unto I do send thee unto them, and thou and thou shalt say unto them, Thus saith the Lord God, showing you that how we're supposed to come in, in the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Alright, and come in his words and not our, our own words. And they whether they they whether they will hear or whether they will forbear, for they are a rebellious house, yet yet shall Slaki, yet shall know that there have been a prophet among them. Right, man. So our people now know that there have been a prophet among them. Even yesterday when we was out there uh, preaching, man, a uh, prophesying, whatever you want to call it, and the uh the people that was uh basically marching for the Black Lives Matter thing. Lady, the girl even said to us, you know, stop prophesying. Why don't y'all come on our side? Showing you how they know that we are the prophets, man. All right. So, you know, with that, Lord willing, brothers edified. Shalom, Israel.